Thank you very much for staying with us. Let's do some hardcore politics now. And delegates of um, the Dr. Qu uh, Kinsley Nyako, I should say, and the incumbent Samia um, Nuama, Samia Nyama, have clashed at the uh, Apatrapa school polling station in the Ashanti region. And what exactly is the reason for this confrontation that we are told? Our reporter, William Evansinkum, has joined us via Skype to give us the latest regarding this. Uh, William Evansinkum, we can see some security men behind you. Tell us what's happening as we speak. Well, so uh, not too long ago, this particular area that you see was a center of attraction when uh, supporters of uh, the incumbent, Samu Kojo Nyama, and then the uh, supporters of the executive director of the National Accreditation uh, Board, Dr. Kinsley Nyako, were all asked for, and as far as the Quadato uh, primary is concerned, clashed here. Interestingly, both supporters have been removed, I'm talking about delegates, have been removed from the register because there were issues with the album, because there were issues with the album, and that's how come Quadato is now having its primary um, uh, they were supposed to uh, be part of the uh, 20th June primaries, but there were issues which was even in court, but the feuding parties agreed to use the alternative dispute resolution. But I can say that when it comes to the issue with the album, they have been dealt with. Now they are using the 2013, uh, 2018 updated album, and that's how come we are having a smooth process. But this particular clash came as a result of the entry of the two aspirants. Uh, the first to enter or to come here was uh, the uh, Dr. Kinsley Nyako. When he came here, I mean, he, as usual, the supporters were chanting, calling his name and all of that. Then few minutes uh, after we saw um, the incumbent MP also arrive, the supporters, as usual, also began to chant and all of that. So in the course of the chanting, then it resulted into insult and all of that. So at a point in time, the military and the police will have to come in to douse a rising fire. Um, they used two strategies. At a point in time, they had to use persuasion. But when they realized it was failing, then they, used, they had to use minimal force just to drive them away from this particular area to allow the process to continue. So I can tell you that now, they have been stationed at vantage position now, as you can see, and that is the military. And then the, the police have also been frequenting um, this particular area. What they are doing now is that when you come here uh, after voting, they ask you to go back to wherever you are coming from, just to ensure that there's some level of, uh, one would say, uh, they've cleared the inner parameter as far as the, where the, 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 the exercise is actually happening, just behind mm -hmm. me. Uh, so that is what they are doing in order, not to, uh, in order to ensure some level of smoothness as far as this particular process is concerned. In fact, if you are seen mingling about, no matter whether you are a delegate or you are uh, passed by, if you are seen mingling about, they deal with you. And, and uh, William, what else can you tell us about the voting proper? Has it started, um, has it been smooth? Apart from the skirmishes you talked about, has the voting started or it's ended? How many delegates are expected? So we are talking about 390 delegates across 10 electoral areas that have been turned into uh, polling centers. Uh, where I am, the Apatrapa uh, polling center, voting, I mean, it's almost done because it just, about five minutes ago, out of the 32 delegates who were supposed to um, cast their vote here, 31 had done that. And I'm pretty sure the last one has also done so. They're just waiting for uh, one o'clock to strike, so they start counting. Um, mm -hmm. Where I, I came from, quite so exactly, before School Park, uh, the, the, it, that place was reserved for the executives and then council of elders as far as uh, quite as the constituency is concerned. I mean, voting was almost done. So in the next one, say, few minutes to one, we should be expecting the coalition of the results and then the final declaration of the results. Mm. And that will determine among the three gentlemen, Vincent Frimpon Menu, the deputy chief executive of the Middle Belt Authority, um, Dr. Kinsley Nyakon, the executive director of the National Accreditation Board, and then the incumbent MP, Samim Kwajo Nyama, who will lead the party into the 2020 mm. parliamentary elections.
Thank you. Thank you so much, uh, William Evans Sinkuma, Ashanti Regional Correspondent there, uh, giving us an update of what's happening in the Ashanti region, quite as a constituency specifically. We'll keep you posted when the results start coming in and do trust us as your election command center to do so. Now,